About one in eight American women will develop invasive breast cancer during their lifetime. But today, patients have more options than ever for treatment. Thankfully, a medical implant called Biosorb is helping patients preserve their natural breast tissue, all while helping pinpoint where the cancer once was. In tonight's Avera Medical Minute, Tess Hedrick shows us how something so small is making a huge difference in breast cancer surgery. Be open to a lot of these medical advances. Becky Lynn Grace was diagnosed with invasive breast cancer in June of 2016. After meeting with the Vera breast cancer surgeon, Dr. Julie Ryland, How are you doing? <laughs> Becky found out she had options. Majority of the time, doing a lumpectomy and following that with radiation is as safe as a mastectomy in terms of your survival. So you don't have to have your breasts removed in order to guarantee you're going to do well. Traditionally, we surgeons go in, we take out the lump, and then we don't do anything to repair the defect, and so then the women's breast, that area caves in, you get a deformity, and it's very unattractive, and you can't fix it. So one of the things I specialize in is when I do breast cancer surgery, we want to make the breast look nice when we're done. This device helps me to do that. It's this small device called a Biosorb that gives breast cancer surgeons more operating options. So when we take the lump out, we have to recruit other breast tissue from the area to put it back in that space so that the, the skin doesn't collapse. This Biosorb is a, a wonderful um, tool that actually sits and gets sewn in place where that cancer was. We sew the tissue around it, and then as, this, as the body heals, the scar tissue grows in amongst that, this biosorb. The biosorb gets absorbed, and then the skin doesn't cave, and the breast looks normal. The real advantage is, is when we do a really good job closing that space where the cancer is or was, it's really hard for the radiation oncologist to know what area that they want to treat for radiation. And it's really hard for the radiologist years later to look at a mammogram and know where the cancer was. So this also has embedded in it, it has some clips, some metal clips. Those sit in that space and even after this plastic gets absorbed by the body, those clips will stay there. So for the future, everyone knows this is where the cancer was. So if we want to, we want to always pay a lot of attention to that area, make sure that there's nothing suspicious going on there. This helps everybody to know where to look. For me, it's also the fact that it's gonna, it's biodegradable. So I, it, I don't have anything per se false. You know, my own, as she says, your own body's going to fill in the space. It's going to be your natural tissue, et cetera, when it's all done. So that was another one of the reasons I was like, let's do this. I have lots of patients who've had radiation and it doesn't, it doesn't affect how this will absorb. So it's a, it's a wonderful tool in our toolbox of how we can do lumpectomies better and how we can give a woman who keeps her breast a breast that's worth keeping. With your Avera Medical Minute, I'm Tess Hedrick, KSFY News. Man, that is just incredible. And Avera is the only facility in South Dakota using Biosorb right now. All three surgeons at Avera Comprehensive Breast Care are using the device. For more information, call 1-877-AT-AVERA or head on over to KSFY.com and you can click on health. Well, the Division II Elite Eight men's yeah. basketball tournament tips off tomorrow right here in Sioux Falls. Yeah. Teams are here from California all the way to New York for yeah. this. Uh, it's going to awesome. be a national champion crown.